Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Watch: Diamond and Silk destroy Democrats during explosive congressional testimony. On Thursday, pro-Trump duo Diamond and Silk testified under oath that they and other conservatives had been censored by Facebook and other social media sites. The ladies systematically destroyed each and every Democratic member of Congress who tried to defame them with their signature no-nonsense rhetoric. Diamond and Silk have garnered widespread support for their videos discussing the Trump administration, politics, and daily news, which they share on their Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter accounts. Trump has long lauded the pair, inviting them to his campaign rallies and to the White House for Oval Office visits. Despite the presidential praise, however, Diamond and Silk's foray into viral political videos has been a challenging one, thanks to Facebook's elusive algorithm and the practice most tech giants employ of censoring their conservative users. In September, Diamond and Silk accused Facebook of limiting the reach of their videos, prompting them to contact the social media giant. They said they received the following message after their repeated inquiries. The policy team has come to the conclusion that your content and your brand has been determined unsafe to the community. This decision is final and not appealable. Facebook admitted to sending that message to Diamond and Silk. However, CEO Mark Zuckerberg, amid his separate testimony before Congress, called it an enforcement error, according to Daily News. Facebook censored our free speech. Diamond shouted at one point on Thursday, adding that she is aware of many instances in which the platform has censored conservative voices. It's not fair for Mark Zuckerberg to dictate to people and tell them what they can and cannot see in their news feed. I thought this was a platform for all voices. Democrats on Capitol Hill attempted to downplay the importance of the Thursday hearing before the House Judiciary Committee regarding the filtering processes used by social media giants like Facebook which have disproportionately affected conservatives. In one of the tensest exchanges at the hearing, Rep. Hank Johnson, DGA, went so far as to charge that the committee was doing no more than giving conservatives like Diamond and Silk a tremendous platform to make a ton of money when this is over by allowing them to testify. What we are dealing with today is giving a platform to Diamond and Silk, said Rep. Johnson you've made a ton of money off of Facebook, isn't that correct? He asked, according to the Washington Post. Let me tell you something, Facebook censored us for six months, Diamond fired back. You know what? We didn't bash Facebook. We brought to the light how Facebook has been censoring conservative voices like ourselves. Shame on the ones who don't even see that we have been censored." She continued, yet when the Black Lives Matter people complain, everybody's up in arms. If the shoe was on the other foot and Mark Zuckerberg was a conservative, and we were a liberal, all chains would have broken loose, you know it and I know it. Diamond and Silk also sparred with Rep. Sheila Jackson Lee, who repeatedly called them liars because they said in a video on April 11 that they had not received any correspondence from Facebook. The pair did, eventually hear from Facebook via Twitter, but not until April 12, one day after their video calling the social media giant out for their silence. The attempts made by the Democrats to discredit Diamond and Silk on Tuesday were met by fireworks from the pro-Trump sisters who refused to be backed into a corner by powerful tech giants or establishment politicians. There is perhaps no one better to fight for the conservative cause on Capitol Hill than these two. Please share their explosive testimony. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.